In 1902, a one-stop extension was built from Fordham Road on the IRT 3rd Avenue Elevated Railway, fondly known as the L, to provide direct service to the Botanical Garden. It permitted Manhattanites to travel to the new conservatory on a single train ride for only a nickel. In this photo of the intersection of Webster Avenue and Fordham Road, we have an excellent view of the elevated structure and one of its trains, as well as the trolley tracks. The extension was located on a 2200 by 50 foot strip of land on the western edge of the Rose Hill campus. It appears in red on this map. You can see that it ran parallel to the New York Central Tracks and Webster Avenue. At the end of the railway was the Bronx Park Terminal. The station was near 198th Street and located immediately north of the campus on the site now occupied by the Rose Hill Apartments. Looking east in this 1916 photo of Fordham University, we can see the elevated railroad in the foreground with a rail car on the far left, the tracks of the New York Central, Dealey Hall, the administration building, Hughes Hall, Collins Auditorium, the Botanical Garden Conservatory, and the Botanical Garden Library. In this 1924 aerial photo of the Botanical Garden looking north from Fordham Road, we can see the baseball diamond on the lower left, where the current Fordham Prep building was constructed, a train on the elevated extension on the western edge of the campus, the terminal dome, which harmonized with the dome of the conservatory, the footbridge over the New York Central Railroad tracks, and the path from the terminal to Southern Boulevard and the conservatory. In this undated photo, we can see the elevated walkway from the Bronx Park Terminal to the conservatory of the Botanical Garden. In July 2016, we found pieces of a concrete pavement in the southwest corner of the Rose Hill Apartments, which resembled the pavement in this photo. This postcard view, looking west, shows the path from Southern Boulevard to the Bronx Park Terminal of the 3rd Avenue L. The entrance to the Botanical Garden is in the foreground, and Southern Boulevard is much narrower than it is today. The dome, which harmonized with the dome of the conservatory, is visible on the north side of the terminal. Sheds and a train are visible on the south side. If you look carefully, you can see the metal fence, which marked the northern boundary of the campus. In 1920, a new extension of the 3rd Avenue L was built from Fordham Road to Gun Hill Road along Webster Avenue. Passenger traffic on the old extension to the Bronx Park Terminal declined. Service ended in 1951, and the elevated structure and the terminal were demolished in 1952. In this photo from 1954, we see the new extension of the 3rd Avenue L on the left and the truncated spur of the original extension on the right. 
When we interviewed residents of the new dorms along the western edge of the Rose Hill campus in 2016, none of them knew that they were living on the roadbed of Fordham's forgotten railway, the, the Bronx, Bronx Park, Park Extension. Extension.